It's been more than 100 weeks since the Indianapolis Indians last played at Victory Field, but that drought ends tonight, Lauren. Well, it's the first game of the 2021 season. WRTV's Brad Brown has a look at what's new at the stadium for fans coming this week. 600 plus some odd days between baseball games here. Just kind of tell me the level of, I don't want to say relief, but almost the level of let's go. Let's have a baseball game here this week finally. Uh, it's high. <laughs> and it's relief. It's anxiousness. Um, we're built on routines and cycles, and we aren't in one right now. So I think that's probably the biggest thing. We're certainly anxious. Uh, we're built to put on events, which we did a lot of during the pandemic, but our business is baseball, so we're excited to bring uh, our players back out uh, and reintroduce that to our fans in the community, but we're really excited to get going. Let's talk about the game day experience people can expect here as fans start to come back out here. Let's talk a little about the protocols and the attendance numbers that are going to be in place. 25% to start off. What is that going to look like here at the stadium? Uh, sporadic, yeah. uh, but uh, that's expected, and, and we're okay with that early on. It allows us to, to get into, um, I think, what it's really going to look like. Uh, we knew it was coming as we work with the health department and, and everybody else and with Major League Baseball. So uh, it's going to be around 3,000. It's going to give or take. Uh, depending on a particular day, uh, just based on how our seating pods get purchased and used and, and all those kinds of things. But uh, really, it's about masks, which everybody is familiar with, uh, social distancing. And, and again, it's the things that we have to do in order to be open. So uh, we're just excited to do it. We'll, we're going to enforce it because we're supposed to and we have to. Let's talk about a couple elements of the game day experience that will be new for everybody a little bit this year. Mobile ticketing and cashless concessions, a big part of the stadium here. Absolutely. Sure. We've been moving to digital ticketing uh, over the last couple of years. This just helps push us across the finish line in regards to reducing as many touch points as possible. So uh, the digital ticking, we've done a couple other smaller events so far. It's been smooth as can be. Most people have adapted to, to everything that's going to happen on their phone yeah. anyway. Uh, the cashless part of our concession stands, again, uh, is, is a, it's been happening. Uh, now it's just going to be official. Uh, it does help speed up our lines uh, and our, our transaction process, which is important because that's the biggest thing I think we, we need to guard against is that congregation of people, and typically that's going to happen in our concession lines. Looking forward to seeing how those guys play out on the field as we yeah. get going here. Uh, have a great season. Have a great first week here, and we're looking forward to seeing how it all plays right. out. Thanks, Brad. We appreciate it very much. Good, Randy Lewandowski of the Indians. Opening night coming up tonight. First pitch right here at Victory Field.